Hey guys, it's Kim here. Welcome back to my gaming channel. In today's video, I have the full guide of as the courtyard in spring once appeared part one. I will also show you guys how to get every single chest as well. So what you want to do when you first go in, you want to turn this mechanism around to point to this gem. And once you've done that, we're going to go to this one here and click on fire. So then that will unlock this gem. We can go and pick that up. Now, what we're going to do is we can go into this next room and we can investigate whatever is on the table. Once you've done that, go back and then we are going to change to unknown chamber. So this is just going to change the room around. We're going to be doing this a lot in this domain. So we will have a chest, but we cannot unlock this one. So let's just go and pick up that gem again. And we're going to put it into this machine thing here. It's going to change the color. So now it's yellow, we can unlock the chest, go to this mechanism here. We are going to move it, so then it will point to this one. Then we want to rotate this mechanism to point to the next one. And then that one should be pointing to the chest. Once you've done that, fire away and then it should be a yellow color. And then it should hit the chest. Once it hits the chest, that is unlocked and we can pick up the first chest. So you can actually come back to this domain after you finish. So if you didn't get all the chest, then don't worry, you can get them all. But I'm going to show you guys how to get them all now so you can save time. Okay, so next one, we are going to go into the next room and we can see something on the table that we can investigate. So let's just click on that. And then you will see that there's a chest in that room, but that's also locked. So we are, we actually can't unlock that yet because if you look at that mechanism, it's green. We need that to be yellow. So change it to the unknown chamber. Once you've opened up the chamber, you'll know what it is. So you can go back to it if you wish. But for now, we are in the dojo and we are just going to fight all of these characters. I'm not going to show you the fight just so we can save time. But once you've beaten all the enemies, we can pick up that yellow gem and then we are going to head back in and we're just going to put that into the machine right here. And then we are going to go back around and I'm just going to change that back to the first room. So once that is changed, we are going to go in and move around these mechanisms so they match up correctly. So we're just going to move this one around here to point to that one. And once they're all pointed correctly, we are going to go and fire. So just to let you guys know, I did this domain twice because I missed a few chests the first time, but I'm just going to edit them into this video so you guys don't have to go back again. But anyway, um, once you fired and that is all correct, your chest will unlock so you can open up that chest. Now we're going to head back out and then we are going to go to the last unknown chamber. And once you open that, this would trigger the next part of the quest. So we're just going to go in and it's going to tell you that you need an Amamori and this is going to have to go into the shrine so we can unlock stuff. So there's one floating around right there, pick it up and we can put that into the shrine. And then we're just going to fly over to the other side, climb up all of these crates and then climb up the ladder. And then we are just going to run straight to the other side. Then over here, just keep going around, down, and then go around again, up this ladder. And then this part here, there are some electro things that shoot out, you just walk through them. Um, and then over here, you will see there's another mummery and also a chest. So we can open up this chest, fall down into this hole, and then you'll be back into that room you were in before, place the mummery in, and then this door will open which will lead you to this part right here. Now you can walk straight through and do the quest, but because we are trying to get every single chest, I'm going to show you guys how. So go to the second unknown chamber and that is going to open up to the dojo. So what we want to do is just go in and we are just going to fight all of these enemies right here. Once you have defeated them, we can just pick up that yellow gem. And then we are going to go back out and then into that machine thing, put that in. And then we are going to go to the third unknown chamber or second one, I should say. So once that opens, 
we can go straight through and then we're going to go all the way down first so all the way down this corridor and then you will see there is a gem and there's something on the floor we can just pick that up to have a look but there's a chest over here so let's just pick up that chest now to pick that up we need to move around some mechanisms so for this one we need to move this one just elevate it twice and then go up the ladder and i think that is all we have to do everything else is correct yep so let's just go out and then we are going to fire this mechanism here so that's going to fire all the way down once again you don't have to do this and you can go back into the domain again if you wish but we all are here to save time right so that's why um yeah we're gonna just literally get everything done in one domain okay so that is going to hit that barrier and then we can pick that up now we're just gonna go all the way back up to put this gem into the mechanism put that in and then we are going to unlock the last unknown chamber so the last unknown chamber that is going to open up and then we can just jump straight down there is a common chest we can pick that one up and then let's just climb up and we are going to go to the very top to see what the situation is up there so just using this ladder You'll find at the top there is a chest that is locked, so we're just going to get that later. But there's a common chest on the other side. Let's just go and quickly grab that. Once you've grabbed that, we are going to change this mechanism here. Just adjust it so it is hitting the one right next to it. And then we're going to jump down. And then we need to change one more. This one here, change the elevation. So I think you just have to change it once. Just check her and it's looking that it's going up and then we're gonna go back to this one the main one and then just fire and then that should fire onto the chest which will unlock so I'm just gonna go to the chest right now And you will see that the chest is unlocked so we can now grab that okay now glide back down and we are going to go back to change the rooms once again to continue the quest we are going to go to the courtyard Once we have the courtyard, we can go in and listen to this Omamori. Once you've finished with the dialogue, we can pick it up. Then bring the Omamori up the stairs and you will find the shrine, put it in the shrine. So we place one of the offerings, we need to do another two more. So right in front of you, there is another Omamori. We can listen to that, pick it up. And then let's just go up the stairs. And to your right, put it in the shrine. Now go to the right and then just jump over behind this screen there is a chest i missed this the first time but now that you've got the chest let's keep going pick up the third memory right here and then we are going to put this into the last shrine so we're going to go up the stairs but then if you look to the right there is actually a common chest so we're going to pick that one up first once you've got that let's go up and then the shrine is just right here in the middle of the stairs so let's just go up and then you'll get a cutscene with Kazaha. There's going to be lots of dialogue, but this is the end of the first domain. In total, there should be nine chests. So thank you so much guys for watching this video. Hopefully it was helpful. I am going to be doing all of the domains. So if you guys want to find out how to do the other ones, make sure you check out my other videos. Subscribe, like if you found these videos helpful and I will come back with more Genshin Impact videos very soon. Bye guys.